Every time Pete Gallego has the chance to do the right thing, he caves. Pete Gallego thinks the law doesn't apply to him. We can't trust Pete Gallego. These are not our words. These are the words of Democrat lawmaker Roland Gutierrez, one of Gallego's former opponents in the special election. Even though Gallego's slogan is, I trust Pete, even Democrats can't trust him. The last senator for District 19 was just convicted for his involvement in a Ponzi scheme that has defrauded people of hundreds of thousands of dollars. The last person we need replacing you, Rusty, is someone so dishonest that he has to convince voters with a slogan just to cover his tracks. Pete Gallego is a failed career politician who after decades in the Texas House, won an election to the US Congress in 2012. After only one term, voters kicked Gallego out of office for his terrible voting record. Gallego even voted in favor of late term abortions. After voters repeatedly rejected him from returning to Congress, Gallego is now looking towards returning to the state legislature. We want a senator whose candidacy is based on a desire to represent our values. Not a senator whose identity is so tied up with being an elected official that he will run for anything just to maintain relevance. Thankfully, we have an alternative. Pete Flores is a pro-life Republican running so that voters in our district finally have a seat at the table in Austin. With Pete Flores, what you see is what you get. And our district needs leaders with honesty and integrity. This election will feature a choice between two candidates with the same first name, but vastly different values. Make sure to vote for Pete Flores on September 18th. Early voting is from September 10th through the 14th. The Democrats and the Austin establishment will be prioritizing this race to make sure they're not embarrassed by an insurgent Republican win. That would make their narrative about a coming blue wave pretty obsolete. So let's start a red wave right here in Texas. Bring your friends and family to the polls and let's do everything we can for Pete Flores to win this. Because in this race, with a vote for Pete Flores, you can truly save lives.